Welcome back to See The Stories, the signature segment of Three Hourly Show on See Today. Now, I brought my lunchbox from home today. Whoa. How are you both? Wow. You've got time. Okay, do you have your lunchboxes? Yes, yeah, I, do. I actually yeah. got time. I try to make time, but I just made Oh, it's so colorful. So Green, simple. red, and um, it's a yellowish a bit. Yeah, it's a stabilo yellow. Stabilo. <laughs> yes. I just prefer... What do you have, Maria? And, so uh, okay, what I have is a balado. It's a spicy... Tofu, wow. yes, this one is spicy tofu and also chap chai. Uh, chap chai is a mixed vegetables and then uh, this one is tofu, it's the protein. I made it spicy, yes, wow. and, and also rice. Of course, Indonesian eats rice every day. Right. That ticks all the boxes. I mean, it's got yes. vegetables, it's got the tofu and... Yes, the, it's a balanced, uh, balanced nutrition. That's right. What about you, Alia? Quite simple. I think this is everyone's favorite. It's, uh, <laughs> it's my favorite. Fried noodle, as you can see, and also uh, egg on top of it. Don't ask me whether this is prepared instantly using the instant noodles or what, but yeah, it's uh, people's favorite. Okay. I mean, for lunch yes, boxes, a lot of your menus uh, are my favorites. Yeah. Because, yeah. What about yours? I love rice and uh, noodles at the same time. Uh -huh. yeah. For the morning, you know, for the morning breakfast. Double carbo. That's, that's, that's a heavy breakfast, right. no? <laughs> but it's make uh, my tummy happier. Hey, yeah. Double carbo. <laughs> right. So, oh, see. What have you got? Whoa. My, oh, that's my favorite. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Can we exchange now? Uh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> why not? Okay, but please explain. I, I'll explain this first. Yes. Okay. Because uh, actually, this is my favorite one as well. So you can see the different of uh, sambal. Mm -hmm. Chili sauce. Chili, chili sauce, yes. the green one and the red one, because this is the, the pressed this chicken. Is, is it? I am the pressed. Right? Yeah, that's oh, right. Okay. Pressed chicken. What should we say in English? Yes, it's pressed chicken. Pressed chicken. Hit chicken. Hit chicken, hit right. Chicken. Not just press, it's more hit. hit. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right, so uh, I, I'm imagining uh, if it's uh, come for my, uh, let's say, uh, my lunch walk when I was in elementary school, yeah. it's quite dangerous because it's quite chilly. Yeah, yeah, it's spicy. Yeah, yeah. Spicy. Not really good for a kid's tummy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah well, right. it's good for a student your age. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, talking about lunch box, sometimes this is very, very uh, pressuring to all mothers. As a mother myself, I often prepare lunch boxes for my children. It is challenging you gotta wake up earlier and you gotta think what you have to you know bring for your kids to school but i try to make it as interesting as possible so in the hope that they would eat it now to find out more information about making creative lunch boxes let's take a look at this next short video so there you go very beautiful very cute. Wow. <laughs> it's getting more intimidating for me intimidating yeah. indeed so there's data from the brookings institution press that is saying Bringing lunch from home can improve academic performance and reduce Whoa. obesity risk. However, it might be hard if children cannot finish their meals, especially when they don't like the food. Uh-uh, that's what's happening usually. Everything. So, <laughs> yeah, as a way to encourage children to eat their meals, families, especially mothers, can learn to prepare lunch boxes creatively. First, we should choose the most interesting lunch boxes, such as our children's favorite cartoon character, to boost their mood to eat and be curious of their meals inside. We can also try different colors like colorful fruit, skewers, or mini kimbap, or even make unique shapes like hearts, stars, pandas, letters, or numbers shaped rice. So I had a different experience, you know. Mm -hmm. Once uh, uh, we had uh, like a birthday cake of Iron Man. Okay. And it turned out my son didn't want want to cut, cut, cut it, it. Yes. because it's too cute no. yes it's, it's just it's favorite uh, uh, he just wants to marvel character. at it yes oh, maybe okay. it could kill the iron man at a oh, time so, yeah. so maybe so choosing the, the favorite character could be uh jeopardize the yeah, last yeah, 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 yeah. boxing menu you should put the villain on it on the cake <laughs> yeah. right. cut, it. So cut it immediately yeah. Yeah. kill it <laughs> okay and to know more about creative lunch boxes let's invite the co-founder of keiko chi or Class Kopi Cilik and psychologist Natasha Dotulo. Hi, Hi. welcome. Thank Natasha, you. how are you? I'm fine. All right. Thank you for your time, for coming here to yeah, My pleasure. <laughs> yeah. Right. So, yes, um, first of all, maybe okay. we, we should ask, huh, how do you see of our lunchbox? <laughs> yes, very simple. <laughs> With the menu, simple, simple but also yeah. a spicy. Not not That's healthy. Not That's so many kids. Healthy. Not so many kids, especially in the younger age, like uh, in the pre kindergarten or maybe early elementary schools, would like messy, you know, <laughs> very natural um, look of lunch boxes like these ones. What do you think? Yeah, I guess maybe the kids will not really motivated to eat mm. and finish the food, mm -hmm. but maybe for us, 
yeah, we can eat it like mm. this one. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. Okay. Well, the, okay. <laughs> well, why is it important for us uh, to prepare lunch boxes for our kids? Creatively. Yes. Creatively. Well, okay. Um, well, nowadays uh, a lot of parents have to prepare the food for the children. They have to bring it to the school. Mm -hmm. But sometimes uh, they already prepare it um, really nicely, good looking one, but um, the kids not going to eat it. Not, yeah. They don't want to eat it. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, uh, I see that the term of creatively making it, the, making the lunch boxes is, is, what, um, is the one is that we can in, uh, involve the children mm -hmm. to make the food and bring it to the school. Mm -hmm. So I think we have to use our creativity also to um, ask them, to involve them wow. to the process. Yeah. Yes. This is, this is very interesting because the pressure, the pressure for the mothers are trying to create <laughs> the most beautiful art. Yeah. But actually the, the, the important thing is to get the kids involved in it yeah. so they, they will feel that there is a sense of belonging, they prepared the yeah. food and they would want to eat it, don't you think so? Yeah, yeah exactly. The, the process of making the food by themselves or maybe just in, uh, involve them maybe just to uh, deciding what to they want to yeah. bring to the school or maybe what is uh, maybe this side of the lunch boxes can be uh, decided by them and this time is decided by the mom mm -hmm. and so that there is an um the process of excitement right? yes the excitement and then they learn that uh, this is my creation mm -hmm. so i have to finish it because yes, yes, yes. i put a lot of hard work in making yeah. it so yeah. they tend to eat like, it it's just like adults when we cook something and it turned out <laughs> ugly and it's not nice at all <laughs> but we just have to finish it because it's yeah. you know, or you just our pride. Yes. <laughs> or, or you just look at your husband. So that's why we, we call Tasha here because yes. mm -hmm. she has the side of psychologist to yes. just explain uh, maybe for people uh, it, this is the simple things to uh, prepare the lunch book. Mm. Uh, some mothers maybe uh, they they don't think before that they can invite actively mm -hmm. yeah. children to create uh, the yes. lunchbox. Mm. So please uh, spill more from the psychology <laughs> side. Mm. What uh, uh, the uh, idea things uh, and uh, besides uh, actively involving the children. So that's why we can we can create the uh, beautiful uh, mm -hmm. lunchbox at the same time. But uh, they really uh, do want to uh, finish it when they have to eat. Yeah, um, research found that. If the children is involved in uh, the making of their food, they will tend to eat the food. Mm. So that's why if we um, involving them in creating anything in that food, particularly, maybe um, from the video we saw that even the choose the when they the process that they choose the lunch boxes itself, mm -hmm. you know, if we involve them, they tend to eat uh, the food that we uh, that the food that we together creating. So um, from the first thing, maybe you go shopping together. Right. Yeah. 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 And then uh, the children can be also be involved in the making of the schedule. So mm -hmm. I recommend to make a schedule wow. ahead. Mm -hmm. yeah. Maybe yeah. a week yeah. schedule. Yeah, I think it's not hard to do when we're deciding. There are so many day. life skills then that you can actually teach to your children. Right. Like managing. Through the lunch boxes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Designing a week of meal, yes. for example, yeah. right? Actively designing Actively together. Actively designing. Yeah. involving them to actively go shopping for that yeah but the, i think the pressure will be the mothers need to you know wake them up earlier yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, try yeah, to yeah. prepare the lunch box in the morning yeah. right yeah. yeah that's the challenging part yeah mm. especially and in the morning yeah yeah so i i uh i really recommend that we plan it ahead mm -hmm. so we know how uh, what is the thing that we're going to do in the morning or maybe some things that we can do uh, in the night before, yeah. mm -hmm. so that's that's going to make your life easier in the morning. Yeah. Okay. Talking about preparing food for the week ahead. Yep. How can we balance the food in our children's meal boxes? Uh, balance the nutrition, I mean. Mm. Yeah. Because children like to eat sweet stuff, like yeah. sugary stuff, chocolate, but they also need to eat the protein, carbs, and yes. other balance. Right. That's or true. right now, it's everyone like or the salt one, like mealy. Yeah. 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 yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Lady noodle, you know. Oh. <laughs> My, yeah, yeah, yeah. My, my daughter yes. uh, sometimes just bought it abruptly in uh, the canteen. <laughs> yes, yes, yeah. yes. Yeah, yeah that's the thing. Yeah, um, the, the meal itself, it's going to be in their lunch boxes. Um, it's their only option to eat. So 
this is actually uh, one thing that we can use as a part of their trying a new food, mm. trying a new healthy balanced diet. Mm. Because um, they will get really hungry at school. Mm. And if the school is don't have any canteen or some uh, yeah. maybe some stalls or yeah. stuff like that, their only option is their own lunch boxes. Mm -hmm. So they have to eat it and yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they have to try it. Yeah. So uh, that's why I encourage um, parents to really look after what is inside their mm. yeah. uh, kids' lunch boxes. Yeah. They have to have a carbs because carbs. the children really needed the energy to yes. really yeah. go to I mean, the school. Who, who wouldn't like sushi? I mean, kids yeah. Yeah. They like sushi, so you yes. can just put a little bit of protein, mm -hmm. fish or chicken, yes. whatever. And yeah. rice at the Proteins. same time. Yeah, yeah. The, yeah. seaweed. So, for the working moms, mm. what is what do you suggest? They're busy, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Maybe they don't have the time for that. Uh, so the involvement of the children will make your life easier. But I know the uh, the first month that you're trying to do this with your children is will be like kind of a really busy and hectic yeah. morning for you. But if you're uh, trying to do this routine, make make a plan ahead, like uh, the week uh, plan, right? Uh, like before, and then. Um, you really uh, think about what is what I can do in the morning. Mm -hmm. Feasible ones. Yes, the yes. feasible one. And you can prepare it in maybe your uh, dinner table or something like that. And then the children, you, uh, you can um, try to make, uh, help them. Mm -hmm. um, you can do this part and I can do this part. Mm -hmm. So if we're if we, uh, doing that together, so the children will have like a sense of this is also my creation. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah wow. that's, that's really... That's a lot of and life getting around the tents in the morning lunch. as well. <laughs> yes. Right. yes, yeah, yeah. that's right. All right. This is getting so interesting yes. and I think it, it does a lot to our kids. So we want to talk more and maybe practice preparing lunch boxes, yes, feasible Definitely. ones, <laughs> uh, especially when you're busy. So now we're on for a schedule uh, for break right now, but we're going to come back with uh, lunch boxes after the break. So don't go anywhere.